Hey guys, this is Fazza from Gamerscore Tutorials, and today I'm showing you how they get the Mind the Gap achievement on Halo of the Master Chief Collection. Now, this achievement, when you read the description, doesn't make much sense because it just tells you four vehicles, one gap on Legendary using Cowbell Catch, Thunderstorm, Mythic, and Tough Skull. So make sure you have all them skulls activated that this is on legendary difficulty and you are on the mission to Savo Highway. Now, Jack from Gamerscore Toils helped me get this achievement. So anyway, when you get to this part of the mission, you are going to come across the first Warhog and you need to get four Warhogs in total. That's why he says four vehicles. And this is where the first Warhog appears in this little area. So we will be coming back for this Warhog or other Warhogs around this area when we need them f to unlock this achievement but anyway because this is on legendary and all the skulls are on it's a pretty pain in the ass so just make sure that you get in a warhog you get all the marines at the beginning of the game to get on the turret and get in the passenger seat and to help you destroy all the enemies on legendary and when you get to this zone just make sure that you slowly take on the enemies don't rush straight in like a crazy man man because you're just going to get annihilated just make sure that you properly get, um, be cautious and attack at the right time and you will successfully get through this annoying bit which will make the next part of the achievement a bit tedious but not very hard so again make sure I definitely 100% recommend doing this with two people or if you can get more than that then get four people but okay there's the location of the second warhog and that is the warhog we will be coming back to get because this one we definitely need so again guys this is another pretty hard area on legendary but as long as you make sure that you're using the tactic me and Jack are doing just stay back as you can see the guns throw a hell of a lot of grenades because the catch skull is on so just remember you stay back and slowly take on them don't just go charging him because they will destroy you very easily just do the tactic as you can see us doing on the screen just stay back let the gunners on the on the gunner of the warhog take out all the enemies and it will make this a hell of a lot easier and after you've done it properly and you've properly killed every single enemy it will make doing this achievement so much easier because we are going to have to run back to this area and if you're coming back and there's loads of enemies here it's just going to be way too difficult and way too annoying and tedious to do so please just end up progressing through the vi video and the mission like this and it will is it is definitely the best way to do it so anyway once that, that we've advanced very far through it we'll, we will end up coming to an area on the massive highway which is famously what this mission is called to Zavo highway and once you get here I'd recommend you killing the, the marines because they can end up like if you go away from the warhogs they could end up driving it away so just make sure you kill them and once you have successfully killed them and your warhog is now clear just head down this highway and head to this part of the mission now once you've reached this part of the mission and you come to this highway where you cannot continue driving your warhog what you want to make sure is you get out now and we're going to head back and bring back two more warhogs this needs to be done in order to get the achievement so now just make sure you head all the way back I'm gonna fast forward the video and I'll talk when we reach the warhog again be right back guys Okay guys, once we're back here and we come back to this Warhog, just get in it. If you have a friend, wait for him. And now we are going to drive all the way back to near the beginning of the mission and get the next Warhog. So now I'm just going to speed this bit up again. And once 
I actually discovered as well that there's a warhog in this area as well. It was apparently tipped over, so you can either get this one or you can go back a little bit further where the original warhog was. It doesn't really matter. Just as long as you and your friend, or if you're doing this by yourself, you've got the two warhogs and that you take them to where that beginning of that where the end of that part of the mission is and make sure you place the warhogs there. Now this is where the gravity lifts is you're gonna need at least two and there's the first gravity lift it's in this building so just make sure you take it and now once you've got that gravity lift just make sure a hundred percent you have all four vehicles in this area and just line them up together because we are going to be using them very fast and now once the vehicles are all placed there we're going to go and find the second grav lift and now it took me and Jack quite a while to actually discover this one not many people know about this grav lift but once you come to this part of the mission there's going to be a couple of brutes and grunts so just make sure you can take them out and once they've been taken out and the path's pretty clear what you want to do is, is head up this like cliff and on top of this cliff is going to be this little building and this platform area and on the platform there is the second grav lift you could actually do this in with just one grav lift but you got to do it very super fast so we would recommend you using two because it's much more safer and much more quicker and efficient so as you can see once you've got both grav lifts get your friend or yourself to place it there and now get in the vehicles and start driving them up onto the grav lift and it will launch them to the other side of the bridge and now you've got to do it for all four of them and once you've done it for all four of them the achievement will pop so as you can see we've already done half of them we've done two and this is the third one being done I got quite lucky there because it nearly went off the end of the bridge and as you can see here this is why you need two because at the last second Jack just missed it so it was pretty devastating but it doesn't matter because we've got two grav lifts so again just throw the grav lift there it doesn't matter which place you place in just as long as you place it where it will have enough force to drive the warhog over and once you've done it with all four of them the achievement will finally finally pop and all that long long um, task of events is done the achievement will finally pop so that is how you do this pretty tedious and annoying achievement but there you go guys so anyway guys thanks for watching this video please check out our previous video which is our halo mcc movie click on our random video and subscribe to our channel thanks guys